So I've got ready quickly as the girls want to go out. Jasmine's gone to Asda to buy an LOL doll. And we're and for Ari. And we're off to the Hepworth Gallery for some crafts and chocolate pancakes. I went to the gym this morning as it's Monday. Happy Monday. I've got an exciting day tomorrow as I'm doing a mental health first aid course. A really, really quick dash from the school run because we're off to Meadow Hall for a Christmas experience. It's a Christmas special. I've got to pick my friend's son up and daughter up. Um, so I've only got an hour, but I'm gonna head to the Hepworth Wakefield Christmas market. So it's Saturday, we've just done our Zumba fun, haven't we? Yeah. For charity, breast cancer haven. <laughs> and now we're getting the train to Sheffield. Aren't we to see a show at the Crucible Theatre called Butterflies? <laughs> We're back at the Hepworth Wakefield Christmas Where's Fair. Here are the crafts we've Where's just done. Oh. And now we're going to go for some food before we see Santa and his Christmas elves in a show called Twas the Night Before Christmas. So I've got ready quickly as the girls want to go out. Jasmine's gone to Asda to buy an LOL doll and, we're, and for Ari. And we're yes. off to the Hepworth Gallery for some crafts and chocolate pancakes. Well, I'm going to share At the Hepworth my own. Cafe. I'm going to share my own alone. That's lovely. Right, come on then. Let's kick off this kids' rule day. Right, I think it's this way then, isn't it, Harry? <laughs> Just wait at the road. And cars can't see you, can they? Even if you can see cars, they can't see you. Because you're yes. super small. to the left. That's it, sit on the pavement. Good girl, that's it. And here we are at the Hepworth Wakefield. Oh, it takes me. Oh look, that looks like New York where Auntie Gemma lives. Yeah, that's New York. It goes through the city, under bridges, and past the speeding cars that zoom by. Thanks, Jake. It flows beside the factories with their machines grinding and plumes of smoke rising into the sky. I've got a full vegan, and these girls have got Nutella pancakes. Whoa! Let's see, Ari, if you can keep your face clean with all the Nutella. <laughs> oh, a playground instead of crafts. The monkey Jasmine is back and she's made me eat this sweet, which is so sour and gross. I hate sour sweets. What is it? So this is what you were doing whilst we were playing with VR. Jazz. I'm too old for playing. You're never too old for playing, you monkey. <laughs> Where's Jasmine? <laughs> Mama, can you just can say <laughs> Mama! She's down here. Why are you down <laughs> there, Jazz? Because I'm hiding from Daddy and other friends. Okay. Oh, Mama, I got mouse on there. Oh, you pick a lead. Where's our pot these lead? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Can I hide you 
Finally, we've come to the end of kids' rule day and I'm shattered. Good night. Jasmine's still watching her iPad under the covers as it's kids' rule day. It's going to be a long night. Look, this is as tidy as our room gets. That's after a day of tidying at home. Well, not a whole day, as I went to the gym this morning as it's Monday. Happy Monday. Um, so I'm sneaky and say I have meetings. Oh yeah, you had a birthday party at nursery, didn't you, Ari? Yeah. Um, and on Monday I say I've got meetings, but really I'm at the gym. And Okay, I'll be one sec, Ari. Okay, I'll be one sec. Oh, and anyway, we've been to Nana's after gymnastics today as it's her birthday. And we've been laughing at her as she's been using our new VR headset. So if you've tried VR, comment below. Let us know what you think or if there's any good videos you've watched. Um, but it's almost as entertaining, I find, watching somebody using VR than it is just using the headset. Anyway, it's bedtime here at Mama's May's house. I can't even say my own name. As I've got an exciting day tomorrow as I'm doing a mental health first aid course with Mental Health First Aid England at the Yorkshire Post offices in Leeds. It's something I've been wanting to do for ages. So I'm so grateful to Yorkshire Post, Yorkshire Evening Post and everyone for getting me along. Hi everyone, so I've just come out of the course. I'm in a rush to the train station as I got to get the right train so I get back in time for the school run. Um, it got a bit intense but in a good way. Um, obviously it's only a four hour course, the initial half day course. Um, so you don't cover everything but it's more about making people more mental health aware which is always a good thing. Um, I definitely like to do the two day course and then see if I'm ready to do the instructor training I think that'll be really worthwhile um, but I def definitely recommend doing it it's amazing when we talk about stress obviously I'm not going to disclose other people's personal information but just how we all experience stress and that certain things can be a tipping point for different people I think it is just to be aware I mean, nothing's ever silly when it comes to mental health. We're all built very differently, which is why it's hard to find a solution because no one size fits all. There's just tips that you can use to help a person, but most of all, to listen, signpost, um, and just regularly check up on people um, to see if they're okay. And, if you notice anything different but obviously if they're in crisis or suicidal you call 999 anyway off to train so i'm back at the train station i hate it i hate train stations this is one of my triggers one of my stress points a really really quick dash from the school run because we're off to Meadow Hall for a Christmas experience. It's a Christmas special. I'm not sure what we're experiencing, so I'm excited. What is it? Excited, Jazz, for Christmas. Yeah. Where's Dad? <laughs> Where's Dad gone? He was in the car and now he's disappeared and we're in a rush to get to Meadow Hall. Let's have a look in there. Shall we have a look in the Let's pub? He might have gone to Lou. Are you ready? Everyone gather around the table, mini people and maxi people. Come on, please gather around the table. Oh, lovely. Okay, so as to shine out the different and wonderful essence of you. Okay? So everyone, pick a star. If you want a different colour, we also have green. And I want you to remember this star. Put this star on your tree. And with the power of the Wishmas dust and the wishes we made, well, I made, <laughs> the power of Christmas will be all through your house. So we're back to settle at, where are we? Yeah. 
Frankie and Benny's because they give free squishies with kids' meals. Or is it squashy? Yeah. Squishy, 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 squishy. Hey everyone, so it's Friday and it's my getting shit done day. Um, so I finally posted on blog, on my blog, mamamay.co.uk, a long post con chronicling, not chronicling, chronicling my journey um, from filming an anxiety attack to appearing on national television live and sharing my vlogs on there. So please do check it out and show it some love. Um, it is a bit of a, it could be a trigger to some people or you might just not want to see my ugly crying face a number of times. Anyhow, um, I've done that and I've got to pick my friend's son up and daughter up. Um, so I've only got an hour, but I'm going to head to the Hepworth Wakefield Christmas market. Yes, it's that time of year. It's Christmas. I love Christmas so much. Although I am aware it is a very difficult time for some people. Um, but bizarrely, I love it. I used to hate it actually when my eating disorder was really bad. Um, now I've still got an eating disorder, but it's nowhere near as um, life halting as it was before. So anyway, I'm going to go to the Christmas market. So come along with me. And I'm child free for an hour. So I get to shop. so it's Christmas time it's starting to feel a lot like Christmas anyway so I've come down to the Hepworth Wakefields Christmas Fair it's amazing it's full of artisan crafts food and lots of gifts so come on check it out to school with these four monkeys. <laughs> Tree day, so we're off to Tesco. We're looking after Harriet and Adam, aren't we? Yeah. Who's doing Come that? Come on then, monkeys. What are you doing? <laughs> You're meditating. Come <laughs> What are you all doing? Yoda. 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 Are you doing a pose? Yes. Yes. I can have a table and I'm watching home. I'm a silly one with a man is watching home. Really? Yes. Well, your mummy's here at Tesco for a treat as well. So it's Saturday, we've just done our Zumba fun, haven't we? Yeah. For charity, breast cancer haven. <laughs> and now we're getting the train to Sheffield. Aren't we to see a show at the Crucible Theatre called Butterflies? <laughs> we've made it through the train station, now we're at the Crucible. Oh yeah. Look, they've also got the singing mermaid on. Loads of police everywhere. Yeah, we can ask. Shall we see if we can, you can spot Grand Popsy first? Okay. Wow. Say thank you. I loved all the butterflies because we all feel butterflies in our tummy. It's Sunday and we're back at the Hepworth Wakefield Christmas Where's Fair. Here are the crafts we've Where's just done. 
the buggy is outside for our make and movers and we've been to see Nana at her market stall and Dad is in the cafe cooking and now we're going to go for some food before we see Santa and his Christmas elves in a show called Twas the Night Before Christmas apparently it's very good anyway I'd love to know how many times you're seeing Santa this year if you're going to see Santa you're seeing them a lot aren't you girls he keeps following us everywhere this Santa so we better be we better be good haven't we because otherwise he'll know if we've been naughty hey I'm call the police <laughs> I'm not sure if Santa will call the police don't worry unless you've been really naughty like you stole something yeah exactly yeah. 